A myth is a traditional story, especially one concerning the early history of a people or explaining some natural or social phenomena, typically involving supernatural beings or events. Mythology is a collection of myths, especially ones belonging to a particular religious or cultural tradition. Mythical creatures are part of the collective unconscious and serve as animal archetypes. In this way, they serve us as our spirit animal at different times in our lives. The gremlin was born sometime around the beginning of the machine age in the late 19th century. He started small by dulling knives, clogging wood-burning stove vents, and tinkering with old toasters. Each new gadget provided more and more opportunities. Gremlin matured to adulthood during World War II and realized his full potential when he began sabotaging aircraft. No one was able to prove that the Gremlin showed a preference for any nation or country. Advancing technology proved to be a fertile playground for him. The Gremlin's family line originates in the fairy fields and woods of England. He is related to goblins, kobolds, and fairies who have caused much mischief for centuries. Gremlin's name originates from the Old English word gremain, which means to vex. Gremlin has distant relatives all over the globe and includes Dokabi, known as Korean goblins, and Sukmangami, the Japanese spirits that inhabit discarded household items. The Gremlins wiki site reports that Gremlins are all very mischievous, dangerously violent, and crazily fun-loving. It also reports that their level of intelligence varies and that, that they are all capable of working and sabotaging complex machinery and devices. Gremlins are only happy when things are in disarray. Most observers have come to imagine gremlins looking like they did in the 1984 movie, Gremlins. However, they are generally described as a cross between a large bat with razor sharp claws and a monkey with a long tail. Myths are an accumulation of man's most fundamental experiences as a human being. To understand our relationship with gremlins, there is a need to look beyond the sensationalized modern gremlin portrayed on the movie screen and seek what is really at the core of the gremlin experience. Physical reality is ever-changing, and we don't understand everything that happens. The unexpected nature of life brings fear and anxiety. The world seems orderly and fine until it's not. We search for answers as to why. We must have overlooked some critical details. It must have been the influence of forces beyond our control. Enter the Gremlin. As a means of protecting our egos, we can blame someone or something else for our problems.
At times it is too painful to look inward at our own shortcomings. The gremlin is unrestrained and crazed by his search for fun and adventure. This reflects on nature at its rawest, most elemental form. Volcanoes erupt. Storms turn into destructive tornadoes and hurricanes. Anything that is born will eventually die, and this is beyond our control. The gremlin is a symbol of the destructive powers of modern civilizations and mankind. He holds too much yang and not enough yin and is out of balance.